Johnny, are you ready to upgrade your 486? You bet I am. Wait a minute, Johnny. You'll need an anti-static surface or you'll damage that motherboard. Oh, okay. Johnny is going to use an anti-static bag. Good job. Go ahead and put your motherboard on the bag. That's a good looking motherboard, Johnny. What do you have there? It looks like a 486, what is that, a DX33? Yes, it is. Well, all right then. That's not playing your games very fast anymore, is it? We're going to make this system about three times faster. All right. First thing, Johnny, is let's remove the CPU. Okay. No, Johnny, that's not the CPU. That's the cache memory, Johnny. That helps the CPU work a lot faster. Just leave that in place. Okay. Go ahead and flip that little lever next to the chip. That's how we remove the CPU. Try and remember how it's oriented, because that's how we'll need to put it back in. You see that little corner on the chip? That will tell us exactly how to put it back in the socket. All right, let's get that replacement CPU now. So what have we got here? It looks like an Intel Overdrive. It looks like 75 megahertz. That should work just fine with this motherboard. Remember how that CPU is oriented? Remember that little chip? That's right. Put it back in the socket with that little chip facing the same way. It should fit right in place. If it doesn't, don't force it. Go ahead and put the lever down. Now we need to make sure that our jumpers are set correctly. Do you know where the jumpers are, Johnny? These jumpers are little plastic tabs and by adjusting them, they'll tell the motherboard how fast the CPU needs to run. So we need to adjust just this one jumper for the new speed. Okay. Wait a minute, Johnny. First we need some memory. It goes right there. Oh. RAM stands for Random Access Memory, Johnny. Okay. Wait a minute, Johnny. You've got different types of RAM there. We'd like all of our RAM to be the same, so go ahead and set aside the one that looks different. That's better. All three of those look very similar. Be careful how you put them in the slots. They only go one way. No, I don't think that's quite right, Johnny. Let's try the other way. That's much better. Let's put the other two in also. Good job. That motherboard looks awesome. Everything should run anywhere from two and a half to three times faster. The old one was a 33 megahertz, and this one now should run at 75. All right, Johnny, let's reinstall that motherboard in your case, power everything up, and let's play some games. <laughs> 